Hi, this is Benjamin from Airtame, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can start a call using nothing but the browser on your laptop. With Airtame's call from browser, you can start a call using your browser without having to install any application or any drivers. This is especially great for guests and visitors who might not want to install third party software in order to run a call system. So let me show you how it works. It's actually pretty simple. All you have to do is open up your favorite browser. In my case, I'm using Google Chrome and go to airtame.com slash go. On that website, you'll be prompted to fill in a five digit uh, pairing code, which you're going to read off of the screen. So in my case, it is in three, six P set. And as soon as I type those in, my browser will instantly connect with my Airtame screen. So I can see it says connected to Copenhagen, which is the name of my screen. From here, I can either share my screen or I can join a call. So I'm going to hit the join call button. And what's going to happen now is on the screen, it's going to load up all the peripherals. That is the camera, uh, speaker and microphone. And on my laptop, it's actually going to load up my calendar, and find all the upcoming meetings I have. So I already synced this up with my Google calendar. You can also use a Microsoft Outlook calendar and I have a few upcoming meetings. In case I want to start a meeting that isn't in my calendar, I can click on join with link and simply paste in a link or even just a meeting ID from Teams, Zoom, Google Meet or WebEx. In my calendar, I'm going to hit the first meeting to join that call. Once I do that, the call is going to run exclusively on the Airtime hardware. So as you see on the laptop, it is just a remote control and nothing else. But I do have some pretty vital settings for controlling my call, including turning the camera on and off, turning the microphone on and off, and changing the, the, the speaker volume of the remote participants. If I want to, I can also share my screen simply by hitting the share screen button. And then I can select a different tab that I might want to show or a window or the entire screen of my laptop. I'm going to pick uh, this other Chrome tab I have open, which is the website of Airtime, and I'm going to hit on share. And it's instantly going to take whatever I'm um, showing in this tab and show it both on the Airtime screen and inside of my call. So I can you know, zoom around and I can highlight something I might want to, to talk about. And if I change the tab on my laptop, what happens is it will actually stick inside of the meeting. So it will stay fixed on the Airtime website, even though I actually have something different open on my laptop. When I'm ready to stop sharing again, I can either hit the stop sharing button provided by the browser, or I can go back into my remote control here and click on stop screen sharing. When I'm ready to leave the call, I simply hit leave call and confirm. So this has been a short little demo of a call from browser, how it works and how easy it is to actually start a call using nothing but your browser. I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching.